Hi, I'm Neil. Welcome to my workshop. Today, making a display crate. This is just showing one of a, a couple that I made for a company called Mine Hair Natural Products. They make uh, natural products, shaving soaps, um, facial hair care, beard care, etc. Um, yeah, that was the first time I used the x graph just to kind of flat pack cut something out and assemble. It worked out surprisingly well. I drew the original design in Inkscape and then brought it over to to Easel. Yeah, I'm just uh, centering the the logo to get it going. Easel's a lovely little program. It really gets you moving quickly. It's just setting material thickness and X, Y, zeros on. Let's go. So I've always found it interesting when these machines carve these uh, artworks, just the path that it chooses to run um, and where it chooses to start. It's, uh, it's, it's always been a little bit of an interesting thing for me. I don't know, but it always ends well most of the time. Just a little bit there. So uh, the best way for, to do the, the whole blacking out of the logo would have been to spray paint it, but the veneer chipped um, quite badly and I didn't have more material so I just wanted to keep the paint as localized as I could here I'm just assembling the the little pieces that go in between um, I just cut them on the table saw it was just so much easier to just cut them on the table saw because it's just straight cuts and off uh, cross cuts and so on so you can can you cross cut plywood anyway um, made it in two sections it was just easier to assemble and easier to to flat pack cut and so on Sanding off the excess paint there. Might have seen some little helping hands in the bottom right there. I love having my children in the workshop. Gluing the sides on. And then we attack it with a little bit of sand sandpaper. Sorry, I missed the bottom of the shot there a little bit. But uh, I believe everything that you make needs to feel nice. So we keep sanding until the, uh, the corners feel good and it feels nice to hold and that's it thanks for watching